Have you ever heard of SIM swapping scams? It sounds like something out of a cyberpunk novel, doesn't it? But alas, it's not fiction, but an unsettling reality we live in. Let's break it down. SIM swapping scams, also known as SIM jacking, is a form of fraudulent activity that is growing rapidly in our hyper-connected world. It's a crafty trick where scammers, with a bit of social engineering, bamboozle telecom operators into transferring your phone number to a SIM card held by them. Imagine that. Your phone number, your personal identity, snatched away from you, and you wouldn't even know it. This isn't a trick that's pulled out of a magician's hat. It's a meticulously planned and executed operation. The malevolent minds behind such scams are not your everyday pickpockets. They are sophisticated cyber criminals, armed with information about you, obtained from various sources, sometimes as simple as your social media profiles. They then pose as you, convincing the telecom operator that they have lost their SIM card and need your number on a new one. Now you might be thinking, but I haven't lost my SIM card, how can they do that? Well, that's the trick, isn't it? These fraudsters are so convincing that they can make the telecom operators believe that it's you who's asking for the SIM swap. And once they succeed, they gain control over your phone number. This is not just about losing your phone number, it's about losing control. Once the scammers have your number, they can bypass most of your security measures. They can reset your passwords, access your bank accounts, your emails, your social media profiles, everything that's linked with your phone number. It's a Pandora's box of personal information and access, all tied to that 10-digit number you thought was just for making calls and sending texts. Yes, you heard it right. Your phone number can be hijacked without you even knowing it. So buckle up, because as we dive deeper, you'll discover just how far this rabbit hole of SIM swapping scams goes. Now you might be wondering, how does SIM swapping actually work? Well, it's a rather intricate process that swindlers have adapted to perfection. And it all begins with the collection of personal data. The first step in a SIM swapping scam involves gathering as much personal information about the target as possible. This information can be procured in various ways. Scammers might utilize information leaked in data breaches, or they might employ more direct methods such as phishing emails or deceptive phone calls. These methods aim to trick the target into voluntarily giving out personal information such as their full name, date of birth and address. The more information a scammer can gather, the more convincingly they can impersonate the target. Now, armed with this personal information, the scammer moves to the next phase of the operation, impersonation. The scammer contacts the telecom provider, posing as the target. They might use a variety of excuses to justify why they need a new SIM card, such as claiming they have lost their phone, or that their current SIM card is malfunctioning. Keep in mind, these fraudsters are often skilled social engineers, adept at manipulation and persuasion. They use the personal information they've gathered to answer security questions and convince the telecom provider of their legitimacy. Then comes the crucial step, convincing the telecom provider to switch the phone number to the new SIM. The scammer requests the provider to port the target's phone number to the new SIM card. If the scammer has done their homework and has enough information to convincingly impersonate the target, the telecom provider might agree to the request. It's worth noting that this process is instantaneous. As soon as the provider agrees to the request, the target's phone will lose service and the scammer's new SIM will become active with the target's phone number. So why is this a problem? Well, in today's digital age, our phone numbers are often tied to various aspects of our lives. They're connected to our social media accounts, our email accounts, and even our bank accounts. When a scammer gains control over a phone number, they can use it to reset passwords, intercept security codes, and gain access to these accounts. In essence, a successful SIM swap gives the scammer a golden key to the victim's digital life, leaving them free to commit identity theft, drain bank accounts, or wreak havoc in other unimaginable ways. It's a frightening thought, isn't it? And just like that, the scammer gains control over your phone number. But don't worry. Being aware of these scams is the first step towards protecting yourself. Stay tuned for the next part, where we'll discuss the dangers of SIM swapping scams in more detail. Why is this dangerous, you ask? 
Well, let us delve into the perils that lurk within the shadowy world of SIM swapping scams. The most immediate danger of SIM swapping is the unauthorized access to your personal accounts. Imagine one moment you're sipping tea, the next your phone loses service. Unbeknownst to you, a scammer halfway across the globe now has control over your number. They can receive your calls, read your text messages, and more alarmingly, reset your passwords. This leads us to the second danger, identity theft. Once the scammer has access to your number, they can impersonate you. They can message your contacts, manipulate your social media accounts, even attempt to access your workplace systems. Your digital identity, carefully curated over years, can be hijacked in an instant. Next is the loss of sensitive data. Personal photos, confidential documents, proprietary information, all are at risk. They can be used for blackmail or sold off to the highest bidder on the dark web. The digital footprints you leave behind, which you thought were secure, suddenly become a trail of breadcrumbs for these cyber vultures. Lastly, and perhaps most distressingly, is the potential for financial theft. In a world where banking is as easy as tapping a screen, your financial accounts are particularly vulnerable. Scammers can reset your banking passwords, transfer funds, even apply for loans in your name. The money that you've been saving for that dream holiday or your child's college fund could vanish before you even realize what's happened. And it's not only about the money. It's about the sense of violation, the breach of trust, the feeling of vulnerability. It's about waking up one day and finding out that your personal digital world has been ransacked by faceless criminals. So, SIM swapping poses a real threat to your digital and financial security. It's not just a scam, it's a digital invasion, a violation of your personal space. It's a stark reminder that in the digital age we must be ever vigilant, ever cautious, because the dangers are all too real and all too close for comfort. Still find it hard to believe? Let's delve into some real-life examples. Our first tale hails from the sunny state of California. A woman, let's call her Jane, woke up one day to find her phone had suddenly lost its network connection. She thought it was a simple network issue and decided to deal with it later. However, upon checking her email, she found a barrage of password reset notifications. In a matter of hours, she had lost access to her social media accounts, her online banking, and even her email. The culprit? A SIM swapping scam. Jane's phone number had been hijacked, and the scammer had used it to reset all her passwords. Another example comes from an IT professional named Mark. He was aware of the dangers of cybercrime and had taken all the necessary precautions. Two-factor authentication? Check. Complex passwords? Check. But one morning, he woke up to find that his phone had no service. Just like Jane, he initially thought it was a network glitch. However, he soon noticed that all his crypto wallets had been drained. Despite all his security measures, Mark fell victim to a SIM-swapping scam, losing thousands of dollars in the process. Our third story is that of a college student. Let's call him Ethan. Ethan was an avid gamer and had a popular gaming channel. One day, his fans noticed that he hadn't posted any updates for a while. They reached out to him, only to find out that he had lost control of his channel. A SIM swapper had taken over his phone number, gained access to his channel, and deleted all his videos. Ethan's years of hard work vanished in a blink. Each of these stories highlights the severity of the risk. SIM swapping is not a far-off threat. It's a real danger that can strike anyone, anywhere, and at any time. It's not only about the loss of money, but also about the loss of personal information, privacy, and in some cases, years of hard work. These scams are sophisticated, and they exploit the weakest link in any security system, the human element. In Jane's case, the scammer tricked her service provider into believing that they were Jane. In Mark's case, the hacker bypassed all his security measures by gaining access to his phone number. And in Ethan's case, years of hard work was wiped out because of a single security loophole. Indeed, these are not just stories, but harsh realities faced by people like you and me. The threat is real, and it's high time we take it seriously. Remember, awareness is the first step towards prevention. Stay vigilant. Stay safe. The question now is, how can you protect yourself from such an attack? Protection against SIM swapping scams begins with safeguarding your personal information. 
Your information is your first line of defense. Be wary of unsolicited calls, emails, or text messages asking for your personal details. These could be phishing attempts designed to gather your information for malicious purposes. Always verify the source before sharing any personal information. Moving on to your telecom provider, always remember that they play a crucial role in your protection. Make it a point to set up additional security measures with them. This could be in the form of a unique PIN or a password that must be provided before any changes can be made to your account. This way, even if someone tries to impersonate you, they would not be able to pass this added layer of security. In addition, be careful with whom you share your mobile number. Your mobile number is often linked to various accounts and services, making it a treasure trove for potential scammers. Avoid sharing it publicly or on questionable platforms. Next, let's talk about two-factor authentication, commonly known as 2FA. While it's a great security measure, it's important to note that not all 2FA methods are created equal. For instance, 2FA that relies on SMS isn't the most secure because it can be compromised through SIM swapping. Instead, opt for other forms of 2FA such as authenticator apps or hardware tokens which are not linked to your mobile number. These provide a more secure way of verifying your identity. Moreover, regularly check your mobile network. If you suddenly lose network service for no apparent reason, it could be a sign of a SIM swap attack. Contact your service provider immediately to confirm. Lastly, always keep an eye on your financial and online accounts. Regularly monitor these for any suspicious activity. If you notice something unusual, such as a password change notification that you didn't initiate, contact the respective service provider immediately. It's important to note that while these steps significantly reduce your risk of falling victim to a SIM swap scam, no method is foolproof. Therefore, it's crucial to stay vigilant, be aware, and always prioritize your digital security. In the digital age where our lives are increasingly online, being aware of scams like SIM swapping and knowing how to protect yourself is no longer optional, it's a necessity. So, there you have it. Practical advice to help you fortify your defenses against SIM swapping scams. Stay safe, stay vigilant, and remember, your information is valuable. Protect it with the importance it deserves. Remember, prevention is always better than cure. So, what have we learned today? We've journeyed into the shadowy world of SIM swapping scams, a place where your personal information is as good as gold. We've seen how these scams work, how they pose a threat, and how they've wreaked havoc in real life. Most importantly, we've learned how to protect ourselves from falling prey to these digital predators. Let's take a step back and revisit the fundamentals. SIM swapping scams are deceptively simple. Crafty scammers trick your service provider into transferring your phone number to their SIM card. Once they've done this, they essentially become you in the digital world, gaining access to your text messages, calls, and even your online accounts. The dangers of SIM swapping scams are far-reaching and potent. The scammer can get into your bank accounts, social media profiles, and email accounts. They can steal your identity, your money, and even your reputation. In essence, they can hijack your digital life. We've delved into real-life examples like the case of the 20-year-old who managed to steal over $5 million in cryptocurrency through SIM swapping. Cases like these aren't just stories. They're cautionary tales that highlight the very real threat that these scams pose. But it's not all doom and gloom. We've also discussed how you can shield yourself from these scams by setting up a PIN or passcode with your service provider being wary of phishing attempts, and implementing two-factor authentication that doesn't rely on SMS, you can fortify your defenses. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you understand about SIM swapping scams, the better equipped you'll be to spot them and fend them off. It's a wild digital world out there, but with the right knowledge and tools, you can navigate it safely. Awareness is your first line of defense against SIM swapping scams. Stay informed, stay safe.